the largest multinational humanitarian assistance and disaster relief preparedness mission ended with a colorful ceremony on board the USNS Mercy on Saturday. A unifying mission that brought together nationals from Solomon Islands, Japan, Australia and the United States has truly served its purpose. In their short time in Solomon Islands, this crew has become mentors, teachers, and most importantly, friends to many of us present and to many of those around this country. To the crew, it is difficult to both fully express all that you've achieved here and the depth of our gratitude for the work. I think it's best to let the results of the work speak for itself and the lives changed, the smiles generated, the knowledge passed. And you all put your lives on hold to come here and lend a hand. And that's a burden borne not only by you, but the families and friends you've left behind for nearly half a year now. This is a tremendous sacrifice. So please thank your families on all of our behalf. Without their support of you, your support of us would not be possible. So thank you and thank them. I'd like to give the families a round of applause. You might recall from my welcome remarks uh, that at its heart, Mercy is here to remind us how important it is to laugh, to sing, um, to enjoy each other's company and fellowship and friendship, to play. And I don't know about the rest of you, but I would say that was a resounding mission accomplished. Commodore Kim even got me, a stuffy old guy like me, to belt a few karaoke tunes along the way. Now, I don't, I don't know if that's deserving of a medal or earplugs, um, but it's, it's certainly worth noting. And of course, you know, much of this wouldn't have been possible without the tremendous support of my team on the ground, and of course, the support of the Solomon Islands people. For Solomon Islands as a host country, the benefits are said to be huge. I commended the construction and engineering team from the Pacific Partnership Mission for the transformation of the railway children's park. The park has now a new fence, which is nicely painted. Two new swing sets have been built for use by our children. Thank you. In addition, the Macy team also conducted a two-day humanitarian assistance and disaster relief workshop exercise with NDMO, NDC, and the Royal Somalian Police Force. This type of exercise also transformed and further strengthened the disaster response and relief operations capabilities, skills and knowledge of our agencies. The exercise has added value to the country's disaster management arrangement. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, the arrival of Pacific Partnership mission to our souls also brought smiles and unity to many communities and individuals through their outreach program. The USNS Mercy set sail on Sunday, leaving behind fond memories for those who have come to benefit from the mission's assistance. The Pacific Partnership is a mission that takes place every year. Jeremy Guao, Tavoli News.